Hey guys, what's going on? James here, and in this video today, we're going to be talking about how the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have had a pre-draft meeting with UCLA wide receiver slash running back Demetric Felton, who... Uh, I'm getting uh, some of this information from the good folks over at the Draft Network. They have Demetric Felton as their 109th ranked player overall on their big board, and I believe he is their 16th ranked wide receiver. But let's go ahead and read a little bit of his NFL Draft profile, again, according to the folks over at the Draft Network. Demetric Felton aligned at running back and in the slot for UCLA's spread offense. He's a very good athlete, as evidenced by his dynamic agility, change of direction, and body control. He's been effective in the run game when used on the perimeter. He runs with the in inclination to get outside and use elusiveness and wiggle in space. In the passing game, he is very good due to his effectiveness with the ball in his hands. He is competitive and willing in pass protection situations. He demonstrates good catching skills on screens and on checkdowns. He is a good route runner out of the backfield, and linebackers have a difficult time covering him in space. He doesn't have the prototypical size for the NFL. As a result, he will likely be a slot wide receiver or a package guy in the NFL. Ideal role, bond of the roster, slot wide receiver, scheme fit, an offense that runs a lot of multiple wide receiver sets. Now, just based off of the very brief summary that we got here, and there are other things that we could look at, like player comp, draft grade, things like that, but um, unfortunately, we don't have the premium profile right now for the NFL Draft Network, so we can't see those things, but Demetric Felton, five eight and a half uh tall and then 189 pounds that means he's five foot eight and a half uh five feet eight and a half inches tall there you go and 189 pounds so a little bit smaller of a wide receiver but one of the most important things that i saw was he aligned at running back as well as the slot for ucla's spread offense this is going to be very interesting now pick 109 i believe that's around the fourth round um maybe later third round but i, I definitely know for sure it is in the fourth round so Demetric Felton could be an interesting receiving back option for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. You know, we've been talking about it all offseason. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers, they need a receiving back. They need somebody who is good at catching the ball. And at least according to this, uh, you know, description of Demetric Felton, not only is he good as a receiving back and just a receiver in general, but he's also very good in pass blocking situations as well. He can be used as in uh, screens and on checkdowns. It seems like this could be a guy who could be extremely, extremely effective with a guy like Tom Brady as his quarterback. Now, this is going to be one to keep an eye on, maybe a fourth round draft pick, honestly, maybe even a third round draft pick that the Tampa, uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers may consider making if he is there. So, yeah, overall, this could be interesting. Um, you know, a lot of people have been talking about receiving back in the uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers free agency plans, but, you know, if they don't get one in free agency, maybe they look to a guy like Demetric Felton in the NFL draft. This is one that I'm excited for. I think think that Felton has a lot of upside uh, and he has a lot of mobility and creativity that he can be used with. Uh, when I see Demetric Felton's measurables, his size, his weight, things like that, um, I think of like a Tavon Austin, you know, and I know that might be like a weird comparison, but I think of a guy like Tavon Austin who's just got, you know, phenomenal speed and really good flexibility in terms of what he can do both as a receiver and as a running back. The experiment didn't necessarily work out for Tavon Austin that much with the uh, uh, like the Rams among some of the other teams that he was on, like the Cowboys. But Felton, you know, if he's used in the right role and he has the right guy throwing him the football, I could see things going pretty darn well for him. And, you know, with a guy like Byron Leftwich and Bruce Arians, they would have to get creative in using Felton, but I think that that's something that they could manage to do. So overall, this could be a very interesting pick for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. What do you guys think? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below about the Tampa Bay Buccaneers meeting with Demetric Felton. Are you for it? Are you against it? Would you want him to be a Buccaneers uh, considered draft pick in the third or fourth round? Leave me your thoughts. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. Hope you all enjoyed. Now we'll see you all in the next video or the next live stream. But until then, and as always, guys, goodbye for now, and go Bucks.